Well, hey there, everybody. It's your sweets of the mess. Thank you, and welcome back to my channel. Please like, subscribe, comment, let me know what you think. I'm new here. I'd greatly appreciate it. Now, you're looking at a nice plate of scalloped and ham potatoes. Yes, and the rest is the best. Keep watching. Hey there, darling bugs. I am your sweet son of the mess here, Chef Didi. How are you darlings doing today? You ready for another episode of Half Baked? So what are we cheating with today? How about your already cooked diced ham? And this new food chopper I just got. As I told you babies, I am the gadget guru, so I decided to try this company's gadget. It's a food chopper, slicer and dicer. Yeah, I'm a chef. I know how to do that already. But I like to work smarter, not harder. So what are we making that we have to use this? How about your scalloped potatoes and ham? Using real taters though. Now I won't tell you the company name yet, in case it don't work, I don't want to embarrass them. Grab your gadget. And there she is. Y'all knew I was going to get it in green. This is the chopper. Oh shoot. The pusher. And there's a little catcher tray. Even got a brush to cleaner. So you don't cut yourself on the blades. No joke, UPS just delivered this to me last night. Grab your tater. Now you want a thin slice when you're doing scalloped taters. Keep watching. Here we go. And we're back. Here goes nothing. Whoop. Look at these beautiful slices, darlings. Perfect. It's a keeper, I think. And it's so smooth as well. Let's get to cooking. Grab about 10 taters. Slice them up. Darlings, go grab your baking pan and grease it up, but I'm going to use my baking fat. Flavor. Now go put on your boiling water. Make sure you salt it. We're about to drop these taters in there for about five minutes. Grab two medium onions and chop it up. Darlings, and it works for your onions too. I'm not being sponsored by them, so I have no reason to fib. Once your taters start to boil, add these. We want to soften these up as well. In the meantime, grab one can of your cheddar soup, one can of your cream of mushroom, and a cup of milk. Add it to a bowl. Give it a mix. I'm going to add in a little bit of Malari's. Half a teaspoon of black pepper. About a half teaspoon of smoked paprika. Grab your ham. Pour it in as well. Three cups. Go preheat your oven to 375. Let's pour on your sauce. 40 minutes in the oven. You darlings know exactly what time it is. Time to go put some southern on our plates. Well, good lord in the morning, babies. Would you look at this beautiful plate of scallop, potatoes, and ham. Yes, darlings. You didn't think I was just going to let that be all by itself, did you? With some steamed broccoli, yes, and some crispy fried chicken, babies, that is truly. Southern on a plate, now in my mouth. Come on. Babies, I forgot my crispy fried onions. Yes. Beautiful. P.S. and yes. Bon appetit. Whew. Oh. Babies, this is a meal all by itself. Please listen to the crunch. Oh. See you babies next week. Bye.